Oh my God, Manny, there's eggs, bro. What? Those are eggs, dude. What kind of eggs? That's the question. I'm about to go look in there real quick. Oh, there he goes! I'll let that goanna right there in the mud, Mike. I'm gonna use the old trick the old Aborigine showed me, all right? It's called using a stick and using your brain, Mike. Hey. Use that wood as something to roll them on, you know? Where's he going? Oh, I think he's on a barrel inside that oh, house. He's going inside of a hole. Whoa. We're gonna be attempting to do the removal, obviously off the roof. So we just let them know that we are here and we are, you know, take it all the way, if you know what I'm talking about. And just like that, guys, a matter of us taking the other iguana out, another one came to take his place. Oh, no, oh, another one popped up, dude. No way. Look, 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 look. Air guns, thank you so much for sending us this. We've got the FX Pantera compact. That's massive. Look at the size of that tail right there. No, look at the big one. Nice work, Roddy. Hey, it's your friend Raj the Iguana Man. On this day, we check into our gated community association job to do some maintenance iguana removal. Also, we have reports of iguanas taking over a roof, so me and Manny decided to check it out. Yeah, we got a couple of iguanas out right now, actually. And we were scheduled to do some removal at the moment. Go for that big guy all the way out there. Nice. Yo, we need some traps out here ASAP, dude. This wall. Yeah. Wait right here, Manuel. All right, all right. Nice. We're after today. Part of the most invasive out here in the city. The silly ooh, iguana. Ooh, ooh. You probably can't see it. It's a bird. It's a plane. No, it's a squirrel monstrosity what's going on here one two three four five oh my he's out he's out he's done going for that one in the yard Oh yeah, most definitely, bro. Wow, dude. Not even 15 minutes, we got three of them. Nice ones, too. Look at that thing, dude, it's like a leopard. Green leopard, look at that. Insane. This one's got a white head. Oh shoot, wow, whoa, whoa. That one right there, Manny. Very light colored. Right. The same color as the grass, kind of. Super light. I didn't know what I was looking at. I just saw something with like grass moving. Look closer, it was like two or three iguanas just eating the grass. Yeah, you can really see like the backyard, like how these people have it, man. This is they lessened out the habitat. Before there was bushes everywhere here. And iguanas would be able to hide. Now there's plants, but it's a lot more organized, right? So if there are iguanas, it would be pretty obvious to see them. Ooh. Right inside this cooler. Let's fill up that cooler, Manny. Oh, yeah. All right. There it is. You think so? He's doing the wiggles. Yeah, there he is. There he is. We have a green iguana, guys. A green iguana that is turning leopard and turning red. And it's got a white head. I. I don't, I, you know what I'm saying, man? I don't know if that's a breeding color, dude. That day was a gloomy but humid day. A lot of reptiles were out. We caught this curly tail just kind of hanging out. And as the day progressed, more and more animals came out to get some sunlight. Check it out right here. We got a pot of turtles. Oh, yeah, there. You see, Manny? Huh? There. Just wrap these trees. Um, See the see the, the the wrap the silver thing. There's a bunch of little guys in here, but there's an iguana up there, guys. He's right there, Manny. Where's his head at? We don't have a headshot on him. You guys see that? Just... 
this is what we're talking about from yesterday just a bunch of babies you can't really catch them they're so fast as you guys can see right now we got a question oh wow almost oh, there oh whoa we did it for a reason we didn't want you in that tree Right there. Oh shit. Where did it, where did it go? It, it went inside those uh, flowers over there. Is he fast? Yeah, super fast. Alright, here we go. Man, if it's one thing that I learned about iguanas, dude, don't mm -hmm. speak human language. Who? There he is. Uh oh. Go behind, behind. We got him. Thank you. Oh shoot, whoa, there he is. Nice. Oh my god, Manny, there's eggs, bro. What? Those are eggs, dude. What kind of egg? That's the question. It's some type of insect of some sort. I'm not sure. Whoa, I was looking dude. at the plant. I was like, dude, this plant has a cool like tattoo on it. No, dude, it's some type of bug or egg. Let's see. Oh wow. Look at it, dude. It's like a little ball. Guys, look at that. What? is that is that a ladybug egg or aphid egg or some type of other egg that we're not supposed to be touching drop a comment let us know um this so far we're doing it we're seeing it we're doing good we're seeing a lot but there's a lot less than i used to be out here but as you guys can see in this ecosystem and in this habitat i mean look at all the trees around here it's insane guys Jeez. there could be hundreds of iguanas around here that we have to wrangle so jump back in the truck let's go see if we can get some more like it was wedged in there. I thought he got hit. Turns out he was just hanging out. Let's go talk on the roof. We could take out. All right. Uh, He's we got orange. a big one. We got a big one right over the hedge over here. That's orange, Mike. Really? Oh. 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 Where'd he go? He went down. He went down. Oh, he just went in the water, dude. No. We got another one right here. Right on the bank. Oh, nice. All right, let's go, let's go closer on him. Right? Yeah, he's walking on the bank. It's a young Goanna. Now we're within range. Right, right. Somewhere in this bush. Nice. This ground is mad soft, dude. I've never quite seen the water so low before. What's going on? Look at that bank, Manny. It's kind of crazy, right? A lot of different territory from what we're seeing from trees, homes. Uh, buildings, see even mud by the lake. That guy just went in the bush. I think he's going up on the roof, Manny. This is a serious problem right here. Very serious problem, dude. Dude, there's just so many all of them. Hold on, I hear him climbing, Manny. If he gets the chance, he will go on the roof to escape, you know? Right, right. Right under that window. Oh, wow. They're burrowing under it. Damn. We're not seeing anything bad, but you never know the impact of that, especially in the next couple years, what can happen. matter of no time like it was crazy i was feeling the tail and i felt it as it let go oh wow it, like it's like its tail had like a mind of its own dude whoa there it is right there though so what you see all right so we just talked to the residents here we let them know about the holes today we are going to be attempting to do the removal obviously off the roof
Alright, there goes one. Alright, his buddy is kind of hanging right there by that gooseneck. And uh, thankfully, these guys covered those goosenecks, bro. That gooseneck is a ventilation system for your house, like to let hot air escape. So an iguana will definitely go in that hole. You, they go in holes all the time. That we take these guys out. And we got another one right there. All right. Nice. Two for two. I have a photo of both of those guys right there, which I'm pretty sure you're getting right now. Some excellent proof of work. They see, you know, the removal, they see what we're doing. They know what they're doing. They know that they're not supposed to be on the houses or eating flowers. They still do it anyways. But he's right there on the bank right there. So we are gonna see if we can sneak up to him, get a line, see if we can put him in the bag. You ready, man? Oh yeah, I'm ready. I'm there forever. Oh no, no way. There's no way. I'm gonna go on this dock and see if I can spook him out. There's water under there. Unless he went in a hole. That is true. There is a pipe there too. Whoa. Oh. You think this is... It's soft? The star's getting soft. Uh, uh, you went under here for sure, right? Yeah. Yeah, no. It's way too squishy. I'm about to go look in there real quick. Oh, there he goes! Nice. Man, this is crazy dude. I've never seen the water so low be like this before. Really? It's like a drought. Look at this this uh, boat right here at the beach. Sheesh. The floor drought, huh? I think so, dude. Unless they're pumping up the canals for something. Look at this bird. Look at these birds. Look at that. They're like plecosaurs, dude. Look at them. Oh, wow. Wow. Like dinosaurs hunting back in the day, you know? That's so cool, dude. It's like a plecosaur. Whoa. Oh, that's beautiful. Wow. Might be him, man. He might have came back. Gotta see that. keeps running dude that's a giant nice. dinosaur dude they're running the banks like muskrats it's incredible man hey you know what i think it is it's the ground that's so soft right now that you know from the drought i'm right here let me see if we can take it from here you might have got him this is just wild dude Push up. Man, good job, man. Thanks, dude. We had to, bro. Kill shot. I see that. I'm just glad it's over, man. Oh, yeah. Whew. Oh, wow. Huh. Gonna throw his tail up in there. Hopefully, he's not. No, you yeah. got him, got him. Yeah, I'm glad it's over, dude. Oh, look at that shot placement. See how it's just like it. All right, we yeah. do need to go back to the truck and collect these dinosaurs, and we'll give you guys the conclusion of this job. Stay tuned. You see another one? Yeah. We got another giant orange one up there. Really? Possibly alpha. He's definitely a male. See him hugging the tree right up there, man. Oh yeah, I see him. Where do you are, man? There it is. Cool. Still up? Uh, somewhat. 
You live that right there in the mud, Mike. Oh yeah. You could for going in there, man. I'm gonna use the old trick, the old Aborigine he showed me. All right. It's called using a stick and using your brain, Mike. Hey. The ground is. See if it can handle my weight, which it looks like it can. Kind of. Mm. As long as I distribute my weight evenly, I should not sink in this quicksand, Manny. Very smart. Fish this monster out. Eddie. Oh, dude. Whoa. It's just a massive lizard. Right there in the swamps of Florida. Whoa. Right out the swamp. Or not. Flip them right here. Use that wood as something to roll them on, you know? Alright. Nice, man. Oh, shoot, dude. We got it, Mike! We got Damn, it! Yeah, <laughs> heck yeah, bro. Yeah! We did it! Nice! That thing's massive! There it is. Two giants, uh, technically three. Three giants? In the bag. We didn't think this many iguanas are right here, but I think they want the property, bro. Oh yeah, most definitely, brother. Really what I want to know. Guys, if we had more gators, we probably have less iguanas. What you think about that, Manny? I think that might be a fact, man. But what would you rather have? Let me know in the comments down below. A bunch of iguanas living by your pond or a bunch of alligators? Nice. Green, orange. They're turning colors, man, like you are saying. Hey, man, same color as that leaf right there. Wow, right? It's just a big tropical lizard. All right, man, we got one more on the roof, dude. And we got to count up, because our time here is up. Nice. When these landscapers come out here, they will be able to go up there and get those iguanas. We're going to count that for the bounty. Come to think about it, now I see why the iguanas love it out here. Nice lake, cool trees, and great houses. However, it's a problem with the local residents in this neighborhood. And that's where we come in. I bet. Where's he going? Oh, I think he's on a barrel inside that oh, house. Oh, he's going inside of a hole. Whoa. So, whoa. See if I can snipe him out right quick. See if he, give me a shot. Nice. Look at the other one. Oh. I think. Dude, wow. friends like curious. You're not off on no more? Oh, I'm next. I'm to take your spot. Yep. Just like that, guys. A matter of us taking the other iguana out, another one came to take his place. Let's see if we can take him out now. Let's go see what happened. Oh, no, oh, another one popped up, dude. No way. Look, 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 look. Another one, smaller one. What the You see heck? it? Guys, so we're taking out this whole mess of iguanas that are living in this roof. Where are they? Where do they go? 
Oh, oh. oh this is right there. Got him. Got him. All right, there it is. We'll snap a photo of that real quick. And yeah, send him in for a bounty. We got him. The flower. It might not seem like much. You might give this to like your grandma or your mom or something like that. But this right here, guys, is like a candy. It's like a starburst fruit chew for an iguana. And inside there, guys, some nectar, some other phytonutrients that the plant has you know so that right there goes inside the iguana gives them strength it's like a candy guys pretty good oh yeah and 14 plus the three that's on the roof right mm -hmm. so total 17 iguanas you know dang all right guys we're gonna go ahead and wrap the videos up 17 iguanas all right that we removed off that house very problematic we'll definitely be back there in the future however we do got to go the weather is going to deteriorate any second 17 you heard right 17 iguanas and about an hour and a half worth of work we're just kind of curious of you know how heavy this boy is start off with the scale at zero kind of pull it to test it see how it's working it's back at zero right all right uh -oh, that okay good. stop for a second oh well, now it is okay there we go. you see what is that manny uh still can't see it's black Okay, it's 8.5, or it's 8, it's 8.05 pounds. Do you see anything or no? Yeah, I see it now. Okay, it's 8, it's eight pound iguana, you know. By no means a giant, but by no means a small animal. It's an 8 pound, essentially, like, dinosaur on these people's roofs. So, that's the correct way I had to wait. Start at zero, have the scale pointing the camera, lift it up, show, the, show what it is. Not, you know, have it backwards and then, oh yeah, look, it's 25 pounds. Look, oh wow, it's a record, ooh. <laughs> Come on now. Out of here, eight pound beast in the bag. All right, we gotta go get this approved by management. <laughs>